22nd year of this new century of this new millennium I want us to begin to give praise and thanks to the Lord Jesus Christ the psalmist declares in Psalm 107 verses 15 and 16 oh that men will give praise to the Lord will give thanks to the Lord for his goodness and his wonderful works to the children of men for he has broken the gates of brass and cut the bars of iron asunder Let's begin to give him thanks right now. 
let's begin to give thanks to the Lord our God. Psalm 107, verse 15 and 16. Let's display both verses and begin to give thanks to the Lord God Almighty for all that He has done for us in the first 21 days of this month, in the first six months of this year, and all the previous years of our lives as individuals, as families, as a church, as a nation. Father God, we give you praise, we give you thanks for forgiving all our iniquities, for healing all our diseases, for delivering us from destruction, for crying us with loving kindness and tender mercies, for daily dodging us with benefits, satisfying our mouth with good things, renewing our youth like new moves, not punishing us according to our sins, not doing us according to our iniquities. Father God, we give you glory, we give you praise, and we give you thanks for breaking the gates of brass and cutting the bars of iron asunder. For making us, oh God, winners and victors. For making us triumphant in Christ Jesus. Father, we give you glory, we give you praise, and we give you thanks. Of a truth, there is none like you. Receive all of our thanks and praise, precious Father. For in the wonderful name of our Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we have prayed. The word of God declares in Psalm 24, verses 3 to 5, who may ascend into the hill of the Lord? Or who may stand in his holy place? He who has clean hands and a pure heart, who has not lifted up his soul to an idol, nor sworn deceitfully, he shall receive blessing from the Lord and righteousness from the God of his salvation. Brethren, the word of God tells us here that it's only those with clean hands and a pure heart that can ascend into the hill of the Lord. Brethren, the word of God assures us from 1 John chapter 1, verse 7, that the blood of Jesus Christ cleanses us from all sin. We're going to plead the blood of Jesus Christ right now upon ourselves, spirit, soul, and body, upon our hearts, upon our hands, and receive cleansing right now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father God, we come before you, Lord God, and confess of every sin in word, thought, and deed. Father God, we just sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ right now upon ourselves, spirit, soul, and body. We receive right now forgiveness of sins and cleansing from all unrighteousness and deliverance from the consequences of sins, O oh God. We thank you for your blessing and your righteousness. We thank you, Lord Jesus Christ, for being made unto us wisdom from God, righteousness, redemption, and sanctification. Thank you, Father, for making Christ who knew no sin to be sin for us that we are today the righteousness of God in him. Father, we give you glory, we give you praise, and we give you thanks. Hallowed be your name, O God. For in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we have prayed. Let's now begin to sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ upon this sanctuary, upon every family represented in this sanctuary, upon all those watching online, upon all those who are participating presently or who shall participate in the future, that the better things that the blood of Jesus Christ speaks shall be made manifest in every life. For the Bible tells us in Hebrews 12, 24 that the blood of sprinkling speaks better things. Let's begin to sprinkle that precious blood upon our spirits, our souls, our bodies, upon the lives of every member of our families, upon every family connected with us in the city of David, upon every family watching online. We sprinkle the blood of Jesus Christ. We ask that the blood shall avail for each and every one of us. And we believe we receive the better things right now that the blood of Christ speaks into every aspect and fist of our lives. Thank you, precious Father. For in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we have prayed. The Bible declares in 2 Corinthians 3 verse 17, Now the Lord is the Spirit, and where the Spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. And we all with unveiled face beholding as in a mirror, this glory of the Lord are being transformed into that same image from glory to glory. We're going to welcome the Spirit of the Lord God right now to come and fill this place with His presence, to come and fill our lives with His presence, and liberate us from every form of bondage, every form of barrenness, every form of stagnation, that He will come and liberate us from every walk of the devil, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Lord, you are here, Spirit of the living God, you are here. Everything that cannot be mentioned in the resurrected Christ, that cannot be seen in Him, that is manifesting in our lives, Lord, we receive our liberation from now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Thank you, precious Father. Hallowed be your name, O God. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. 
the Bible declares in Psalm 90 verses 1 to 3 we we'll read Psalm 90 verses 1 to 3 and then verses 13 to 17 together even as we enter into our time of praise brethren I want us to forget about ourselves for this next period let's just concentrate on him and praise and worship the one who is worthy one to go Lord you have been our dwelling place in all generations before the mountains were brought forth or ever you have formed the earth even from everlasting to everlasting you are God verse 13 return O Lord how long have compassion on your servants oh satisfy us early with your mercy that we may rejoice and be glad all our days make us glad according to the days in which we have been afflicted the years in which we have seen evil verse 16 let your work appear to your servants and your glory to their children and let the beauty of the lord our god be upon us and establish the work of our hands for us yes establish the work of our hands praise ye the lord praise the lord hallelujah lift those hands above your head and praise the living god go ahead and praise god he's worthy of praise he's worthy of praise yes it's the praise hour to our god he's been good he's been good his name is jesus his name is jehovah he's worthy he's worthy of praise and we are so glad to praise him this morning it's our pleasure put your hands together for him if you know you're happy to praise him put those hands together for him hallelujah amen jesus jesus it is with much pleasure that i praise your name that's right jesus jesus it is with much pleasure that i praise your name i don't know about your jesus say it jesus that's right jesus, that's his name it is with much pleasure that i praise your name jesus 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 it is with much pleasure that i praise your name oh jesus jesus my lovely jesus, jesus yes it is with much pleasure that Praise your name. Oh, yeah. Jesus. Yeah. Jesus. Give us with much Jesus pleasure. With much pleasure that I praise your name. Listen, listen. The birds of the air, they sing unto you. The trees of the fields, they clap their hands. Ha! And the mountains and valleys, they burst into song. Come on. Why should I praise your name? Come on, say that. Jesus. That's right. Jesus. Oh, it is with much pleasure that I praise your name. Jesus. Jesus. My lovely Jesus. Jesus. It is with much pleasure. It is with much pleasure that I praise your name. One time. Jesus, Jesus. Jesus. Oh, my Lord. Jesus. Oh, my Savior. It is with much pleasure that I praise your name. Jesus. It is with much pleasure. Let's say it one more time. The birds of the air, the birds of the air, they're singing to you. That's right. They clap. clap their hands. The mountains and valleys dip into. So why shouldn't I praise your name? Praise your name. Jesus. Oh, Jesus. It is with much pleasure. It is much pleasure that I praise your name. There's no better place. God in your presence, Lord, praising you. It is with much pleasure that I praise your name. So we say, uh, hallelujah. Put your hands, come on, put those hands. Just let it flow in that. Hallelujah. Yeah. Ah, praising the Lord. Always. Praising the Lord. Always praising the Lord with all my heart. Praising the Lord with all my heart. Always praising the Lord. Praising the Lord. Always. Always. Praising the Lord. Praising the Lord. Every hour of the day. Always. Praising the Lord. Praising the Lord. With all my heart. With all my heart. That's right. Praising the, the Lord, Lord with all my heart. Always. In the morning, praising the Lord. Praising the Lord. Yes, in the noontime. Always. Praising the Lord. Praising the Lord. In the good times and the bad times. Praising, praising the Lord. No matter what I'm going through. Praising the Lord. Praising the Lord. With all my heart. Always. 
Alléluia. Si Alléluia, ça. Your Lord is good. Hey, no matter what. Si Alléluia. My Lord is good. Jehovah is good. Come on, say. Alléluia. No matter what the situation says, the Lord is good. Praise you, oh my savior. I will praise you, oh my savior. I will praise you, oh my savior. I will praise you forevermore. I will praise you. It's all about praise this morning. Come on. When you praise him, you have to praise. I will praise you. Yes, everybody knows. Say now you the The living God. Jehovah, now you the rain, no. Now you the rain, no. Jehovah, now you the rain, no. Now you the rain, no. I sat to the east and the west, I found nobody. Go ahead, go ahead, play it. That's right. He rains in my situation, he rains in your situation. Ha! Thank you, Jesus. Let's say it one more time. Are you ready to say it? That's right. I serve a living God. I serve a living God. Oh, even the devil. Yes, even the devil knows. I serve a living God. Everybody knows. Say now you I can I serve a living God. Hey! Yes, they know, they know. We serve a living God. This sanctuary, he reigns. All his angels are scattered all around. He reigns. He controls. Hey, Jehovah reigns. Can I get a witness this morning and say, Hey, Jehovah reigns. He reigns. Go sober, be Jesus. Oh, you go in Jehovah reigns. He reigns. You are lifted up. Lifted up, my God, you are lifted up above the God. Above the God, no, you are lifted up. You are lifted up. You are lifted up. Upon sickness and diseases and every situation. Above, 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 above. To the highest place, highest place. You are lifted up. Lord, we give you all the praise. Lord, you are lifted up. You are lifted up. You are lifted. 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 Jehovah, 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 Jehovah. Jehovah, 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 Jehovah. Break it down. Go 
है That's right. Everywhere. Yes. There's no God like that. Jehovah, that's his name, oh. Jehovah, 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 wait, wait, when you are going through something and you don't even know what to say, you don't even know what to say, you want to pay your bills, just say, Jehovah, Jehovah, when they are chasing you, say Jehovah. Hey. Call his name. Jehovah. Can I get a witness? Jehovah. Hey. Jehovah hey. That is what I do. Jehovah. Jehovah. Hey. Jehovah hey. He will surely show up. Jehovah. I can hear you. Je- Jehovah. Hey. No darkness at all. He's good. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. My God is good. Everything I do put up Hey. Double, double. Everything I do put up hey. double, double. Everything I do put up double, double. Everything, 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 everything. Everything self not triple, triple sometimes. Not triple, triple. In my house not double, double. Oh. Not double, double. In my job not double, double. Oh. Not double, double. Even my praise not double, double. Oh. Not double, double. Go ahead and praise him. Go ahead. My God is good. My God is good. Okay, now just go ahead and say to yourself. Ah, tell yourself, say, say, my God is good. My God is good. My God is good. He's so good. My God is good. My God is good. My God is good. Forget the person. My God is good. My God is good. My God is good. Look, forget. My God is good. Oluadara, 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 Oluadara. You are Dara said, in the morning, Dara, in the evening, Dara, in the night, and Dara, you are 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 Dara, I'm gonna still with you 
Landing. We're coming for you and just spread your wings. We're about to land in his praise. Hallelujah. That's right, play it. Aha. Aha. Ale wile she lo nje be. Ala kbata ino. Ala wo tele o. Igu e. This thing you can do. That's it. Bire, oh, taloda bire, oh, alabara, bire, oh, 
Talo da bire Halandara Obatoko That's why Latino go Latino go Obatiki isu Hey Obatiki re Talo da bire Alakara Bire Talo da bire Alakara
the beginning. You are the Alpha and the Omega. You reign.
like fire, we call on you, Yahweh. Yahweh, Yahweh, do something. Yahweh, Yahweh. Yahweh. I like the song. Arabata ribiti, hey, ribiti rabata. It's a very simple song. I've searched all over. Nobody is like you. I'm about to repeat it. I repeat it. I'm about to. I searched all over. Nobody is like you. Sing it out loud.
Jesus Christ we have worshipped. The Bible declares in Revelation 19 verses 1 to 6, After these things I heard a loud voice of a great multitude in heaven. Revelation chapter 19 verse 1, saying, Hallelujah, salvation and glory and honor and power belong to the Lord our God. For true and righteous are his judgments, because he has judged the great hallow who corrupted the earth with our fornication. And he has avenged on her the blood of his servants shed by her. Again they said, Alleluia. Her smoke rises up forever and ever. And the twenty-four elders and the four living creatures fell down and worshipped God, who sat on the throne, saying, Amen, Alleluia. And the twenty-four elders and the four living creatures fell down and worshipped God, who sat on the throne, saying, Amen, Alleluia. Then a voice came from the throne saying, Praise our God, all you his servants, and those who fear him, both small and great. And I heard, as it were, the voice of a great multitude, as the sound of many waters, and as the sound of mighty thundering, saying, Alleluia, for the Lord God omnipotent reigns. I am the Lord that he left thee. Christ is here right now. If you are sick in any area of your body, I want you to place your hands there and begin to receive his healing right now in the name of Jesus Christ. If you require healing in any other area of your life that is not physical, place your hands upon your head and begin to receive his healing right now into your home, into your finances, concerning your marriage, your business, all the work of your hands. Begin to receive his all-round health and healing. Today marks the end of every sickness, every affliction, every infirmity, every illness, every disease in our bodies and in our lives. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, because you are the God that he left me. Brethren, believe you receive that which you have asked of him and it shall be to you in Jesus precious name for as many as are here right now just tell him Lord I believe I receive my wholeness in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth Father I believe I receive my wholeness now in the name of Jesus Christ wholeness physically wholeness materially wholeness matrimonially wholeness emotionally wholeness in our businesses in our careers as a church as a family as a people in the name of jesus christ as individuals lord we receive all around wholeness blessed be your name O lord in the name of jesus christ of nazareth we have prayed amen and amen brethren the greatest disease however is spiritual the greatest disease is spiritual if you are here today and your name is not in the Lamb's Book of Life, and you want your name in the Lamb's Book of Life, or you're not sure whether it's there, whether it has been blotted out, I want you to stretch forth your hand. I just raise up your hand right now to him. If you are here today and you want your name in the Lamb's Book of Life, all heads bowed, all eyes closed, please. God bless you. For those who are online, I want you to place your hand upon your head right now. Place your hand upon your heart if you are saying this prayer and you want your name in the Book of Life. And for those who are also here, place your hand upon your heart and begin to say this word after me. Heavenly Father, I thank you 
for the gift of your son, Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus, I receive you as my savior. I receive you as my Lord. I ask you to come into my heart. Take out of me all that is not of you. Put back in me all the enemy has taken out of me. Fill me with your Holy Spirit. Write my name in the book of life. F help me from today to live for you. And on that last day in your kingdom in heaven, let me not be found missing. Let me not be found wanting. Thank you, precious Father, for in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Brethren, the Lord Jesus Christ made us a promise in John chapter 14, verses 13 and 14. And he said in that scripture, he says, Whatsoever things you ask in my name, that I will do, that the Father may be glorified in the Son. He said, if you ask anything in my name, I will do it. I want you to go before him right now and ask him for something that only God can do, that will bring glory to God the Father, and that you will testify of before the people of God when it is made manifest in your life within the next seven days. I want you to ask him for that which only God can do. That which, if a man can do it for you, don't ask it. Ask him for that which only God can do. He has he's not a man that he should lie. John 14, 13 and 14. He has said, whatsoever things you ask in my name, that I will do, that the Father may be glorified in the Son. Father God, I ask in the name of, I will go off the mic for a few moments myself. Let's begin to bring our prayers to a close with thanksgiving even and begin to thank him right now. Begin to thank him for that, those things you have asked of him that will bring glory to God the Father and vow to testify and give him the glory and give him the praise. Father, we bless you. Thank you, Lord God, for making haste to help us. Thank you, Lord God, for making haste to us, O God Almighty. Thank you, precious Father God, for making haste to help us, O oh Lord our God. Thank you for letting them be ashamed and confounded who seek our lives. Thank you for turning them back and consuming all those who desire our hurt. Thank you, Lord God Almighty, for letting all those who love your salvation say continually be magnified. Father God, thank you for making haste to us, our help and our deliverer. We give you glory, we give you praise, and we give you thanks. For in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, we have prayed. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. We're going to give a thanksgiving offering. How many of us have received anything from the Lord today? Amen. That which we have received shall be permanent. We're going to give a thanksgiving offering. But you know, it's more blessed to give than to receive. Acts 20, 35. Why? Because Proverbs 10, 22 tells us it's only the blessing of God that makes rich and adds no sorrow. So I want us to rise up on our feet with our tithes, our offerings, our thanksgiving offerings, with them before the Lord and begin to thank him. Amen. Even as we display Ezekiel chapter 34, verses 25 to 30. Ezekiel 34, 25 to 30. Let's begin to thank the Lord for all that he has done. Indeed, it shall be permanent. Ezekiel 34, 34, 25 to 30. Ezekiel 34, 25 to 30. I receive this word in my spirit again. Amen. For God is saying that he will enter into it by this offering. He will enter into a covenant of peace with us. Amen. And cause wild beasts to cease from our land. Amen. He says that we shall henceforth dwell safely. Amen. Verse 26, verse 27. He says it will make us a blessing. There shall be showers of blessing. He says in verse 27, he says in verse 27, then there shall be exceeding great fruitfulness. There shall be exceeding great increase. There shall be safety. And we shall know that he is the Lord. 
we will be liberated from all yokes and delivered from all her enslavement in Jesus mighty name from this day forward verse 28 he declares we shall no longer be a prey he says nor shall we experience any devouring he says we shall dwell in safety no one shall make us afraid verse 29 he says he will raise us up amen he will beautify our lives we will no longer be consumed with hunger nor be ashamed anymore verse 30 he says that we shall know that he the lord our, our god is with us and we are his people amen be lifted up be lifted up Please let's give our offerings right now amen from this day forward, in every area, every aspect of it of our life, go Lord, we live Brethren, the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you. The Lord be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we have prayed. Let's share the grace together in fellowship. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Believe.